well, well, hello to you again, Internet. I am Princess Deadpool, and I am here with my now fully recovered friend, Max. He's over his heartbreak. And the ever so adorable Pinkie Pie, the plushie. Mwah! You are so cute. Perch on my arm. And now, let us watch some shit! X don't give it to you. Wait for you to get it on your own. X don't deliver to you. Not open up the door to spray. This reaction is going to be to My Little Pony, Season 7, Episode 21. What was it called again? Fuck. Uh. Oh yeah, Mars and Recreations. <laughs> I forget shit. Anyway, this actually is going to be a Crusader episode, and again, well, ever since they got their cutie Mars, we haven't really been seeing a lot of Crusader episodes. But apparently in this one, they're going to be starting up a day camp-like program for other ponies to get their cutie marks together? Interesting. I, I actually kind of like that idea. Like, have them all get theirs together like the three of them got theirs at the same time so they can all share the moment as one? That's actually an interesting idea. Good on you, Crusaders. You have very good minds about you. I am proud of you. I am very excited to see where this goes. That being said, let's get started. And once that pointer comes into view... I will start it. Oh, they found it. I found it. I fucking found you, you stupid pink pointer. No, not you. The, the cursor on my computer, it's Pinkie Pie themed, so I'm talking to the cursor, not you. Don't worry. You're still awesome. I love you. Speaking of awesome, where's Rainbow Dash? I haven't seen that plushie in a while. Oh. She's in my bed napping. Wait, how did I not notice that? I sleep in that bed the whole time. She was there all along? Oh, you know what? I have some questions to ask Rainbow Dash after this reaction here is done, but let's get to it. Uh, all right, here we go. Uh, Marks and Recreation starting in three, two, one. Who is this pony? And she's painting with her mouth. Okay, let's see how you're still laughing. How do you do it? Long kettle corn. Kettle corn? <laughs> she drew a circle. Oh, that certainly is <laughs> round. I can make it rounder. So they're like a therapist's office, they're paid by the minute. It's like, are they paid at all? And the nose tips touched. We used to. Oh, but it had to be somewhere big enough to handle all those blank blanks. Somewhere outside, with tons of activities to try. Are you two thinking what I'm thinking? She are day camp! And I don't know just the place. Applejack used to go there when she was little. Cap friendship! <laughs> Sorry. I thought we were all gonna yell that one too. <laughs> Miss coordination between teammates. You gotta get that shit down. Bat your eyes at the camera, Rarity. I can't. This mask does not have blinking vision. Come to me, sweet episode. I thirst for you. That sounded wrong. Forget that. Crusader balloons. Cool. This is where the internet would be a good idea for Equestria. But they are ready for it. Rumble! Oh, hey, 
Crusaders. Look, I can't stop. Gotta meet my brother for something. No problem. Just want to. You have a different voice from when you first appear in season two. The first session's tomorrow. What's your deal? What you got there? Thunder Lane! What? Oh, nothing. Come on. I want to show you a new dive roll I'm trying. Come what? Come on! <laughs> Is this gonna have a lot of Thunder Lane in it? It is! It is! Thunder Lane! Interesting! Who's excited to be here? Well, we're excited too! At Kicking Mark Day Camp, you'll be able to try all kinds of things. Kayaking! Horseshoe tossing! Circle painting! <laughs> Kettle corn! Most important thing I like her. Circles are fun. Then I bet it'll work for these little guys too. Thunder Lane! I thought you said we were gonna go practice for the Wonderbolt Ponyville Extravaganza show. I'm going to Wonderbolt practice. You're going to Cutie Mark practice. And we're going Wait a minute. To Thunder Lane's a full Wonderbolt now? What the hell did that happen? I can't believe your own friend. Is he just a backup or some shit for Rainbow? What the hell? She's a wonderful too. <laughs> but he's there. She's not. Difference. I know she'll be mad if I'm late. Now you have a good time and try some stuff. Who knows what you'll be good at? Dang, Thunderlay! You got skill! Looks like we found the first activity of the day. The horseshoe toss! <laughs> I don't get it, Rumble. What's your deal? Play, but it's time to fly. Have fun! Okay. Stop showing off, go. You're much like Rainbow Dash. Come on, Rumble. Step on up and show us how it's done. No way he's as good as his brother. Uh, whoops. Oh, oh so, so that's his deal. Jealousy of his brother. I wasn't worried. Good, because there's a ton of other stuff to try. We'll find you something you're good at. <laughs> so they can't shoot bows and arrows with their hooves. <laughs> They're dancing? Hey, those dance lessons she took with tender tabs actually rubbed off! <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> the first and last lines have five syllables, but the middle has seven. It's called a haiku! Haiku! Interesting! Oops. I've tried it all. Time to tell my brother this camp isn't for me. You're a bad actor, dude. Uncle, isn't it fun just trying stuff? Not really. <laughs> hey, she got hers! Oh, that's so cute! She got her cutie mark and haikus! What is the pony version of Japan? She still likes the circles. <laughs> I like that. She got a cutie mark or something, but she still likes doing the circles. Wow! I can't believe we got a cutie mark on the first day. Yup, this camp was a pretty swell idea. Every pony's really enjoyed it. <sighs> Every pony except Rumble he didn't have much luck with anything. Trying to find out what you're meant to do can be frustrating. You remember how long it took us to get our cutie marks? <laughs> I remember the nightmares. Well, <laughs> and I'm sure all of Ponyville does too. Convince him to come back and try harder. Mm -hmm. Hey, Rumble. What are you all doing here? We just want 
wanted to apologize for not finding anything you like today. Oh, whatever. It's fine. It's not fun. It's frustrating, and we know what it's like. I'm not frustrated. It's okay. We've all been there, but we won't give up on helping you. We know you'll get your cutie mark. Every pony does. Actually, I don't need your help because I don't want to get my cutie mark. What? Ooh! What the hell? Oh, oh. Cutie mark. <laughs> you said it again. <laughs> Did they just Is that like the Ponyville version of the F word? What the hell? Every pony wants to know what they're meant to do. Hm, not this pony. Why? Because cutie marks are silly and and they just force you into one thing your whole life. That's silly. Having a cutie mark doesn't mean you can't do other things. Yeah. Our cutie marks aren't helping ponies with their cutie marks, but I still like making potions with Zakora. And when was the last time you did that? Um, I, I think it was... <laughs> well, we've been pretty busy helping other ponies lately. Oh, you mean doing the thing you got your cutie mark for? The thing you're stuck doing for the rest of your life? I am loving this. Maybe we will be doing that more than anything else. But we love being cutie mark crusaders. Well, that's fine for you, but I'm not going to be put in a box. A blank flank who doesn't want a cutie mark? That's got to be the strangest thing I've ever heard. Granny always says, some ponies have to find their own hay. Are you sure she didn't mean find their own way? Oh, huh, that would make more sense. Maybe you do have hay in your apple bloom. Get it checked out! Either, but we can't force him. And we've got a whole camp full of ponies who are interested in cutie marks. Okay, all right. He wants to. Here he comes. The fastest, most elite flyer in Equestria. Dude, what the fuck? I was gonna say me. You're not the only Pegasus in the family, you know. Well, sorry, little brother. You're right. You might be the most elite flyer in Equestria someday, but for now, you should try other things too. Speaking of which, aren't you supposed to be at camp? That camp is for losers who can't do anything. Great, so there's no pressure. You can try everything and not be worried about looking bad. I'm not worried about that. I just don't want to get a cutie mark in any of their ridiculous activities. Well, you're still going back tomorrow. You can't be a blank flank forever. <sighs> you just gave him an idea. Good on you, Thunderlane. For good sure. stuff, is he? You'll be too busy haikuing from now on. But I like circles. Come on, Rumble. That's not how cutie marks work. So that's how cutie marks work? Uh oh. <laughs> They're losing them! Not good! Cutie marks are great, they say. A song! This is interesting! I love this! I can't remember if we've ever gotten a song with a male lead, other than that one Discord song. Like just being you. 
They keep the max blank, blank, blank is a thing to do. Beauty marks don't limit you. Blank, blank. They only show you what you can do. Blank, blank. But what if you can't do a thing? Blank, blank. These kitty marks are frustrating. You say there's nothing you can do. What do you think about this, though? Huh? This is actually very enjoyable! I'm loving this so much! Push that boat! She painted over her cutie mark! Wow! To do. I am loving this. That kid is a little rebel, and I love it. Now wait just an apple picking minute, Grumble. Where do you think you're leading our campers? They're not your campers anymore. I'm starting a new camp. Every pony on this side of the line is in Camp Blank Blanks forever! Uh oh. Well, you can't be a Blank Blank forever! Oh, that's just the kind of talk I'd expect to hear from Camp Cutie Mark. Which is why Blank Blanks need a camp where we can enjoy being Blank Blanks and appreciate our Blank Blankiness without feeling pressured to get a Cutie Mark! Now, hold on, every pony. Blank Blanks forever! <laughs> You're holding on! I love the way Pepsi runs! Like, hop, hop, hop! What just happened? Has every pony gone mad? In a word? Yes. <laughs> I just can't see what we did wrong. I thought every pony was having fun. Isn't that Derpy's line? Rumble came and made a mess of things. What are they doing now? It looks like whatever they want. <laughs> Honestly, it's not all that different from what they were doing here. Then, what was the point? Point is that Rumble is a mad pony who must be stopped. Now calm down, Crusaders. We just need to talk to him again. The key is to remain calm. Cutie Marks! Yeah. <laughs> Good going, sweetie Bell. Uh, wouldn't that fucking hurt? You just rammed your head into a unicorn's head. One of them actually will get a cutie mark from just doing absolutely nothing, won't they? But then they're just gonna do nothing. <laughs> and she just goes back to her circle. Well, what's with that random ore floating in the pond? What says? What was that? Older brother. Let me get this straight. My little brother upended your entire camp. How in Equestria did he do that? Ventura would be proud. Well, that doesn't make a lick of sense. Unless he was being bad at stuff on purpose. Yes, Zeke! Um, I was afraid of this. Afraid of 
Afraid of what? Ever since I became a Wonderbolt, Rumble's either watching me or trying to fly like me. He won't do anything else. That's why I thought your camp was such a good idea. I don't understand. If Rumble wants to be a Wonderbolt someday, what's wrong with that? Not a thing. But right now, he isn't even giving anything else a chance. Sounds to me like Rumble isn't afraid of being put in a box at all. It doesn't? Nope. I think Rumble's already picked out a box. He's afraid he'll get a CUNY mark that'll keep him from it. Ooh! Very interesting. I don't know how to say this, Rumble, but Blank Flank Forever Camp is kind of... Boring? If we want to see blank flanks, we can't risk it. <laughs> we get a cutie mark and being bored. Attention, blank flanks of cutie mark playcamp. <laughs> he just jumps over. <laughs> out from them <laughs> Any pony who's interested gather round for a day of camp activities with a genuine wonder book. Are we ever going to hear the story about how he got called up to ranks seriously but cutie mark or not I'm not missing out on this <laughs> <laughs> he just stands there. Wow. <laughs> Sheesh. Just go. <laughs> hey, Twilight's house. On, dude, just do it. Wonderling, aren't you gonna run the course? No, nope. I know I'm a Wonderbolt, and my cutie mark is all about moving fast, but I really like to cook. Since when? Well, we take turns making the meals at Wonderbolt HQ. I didn't want to at first, but now they take I turns. I just wish I tried it sooner. You do? Of course. There's more to me than just flying, and I bet there's more to you too. Aww, it's so cute. Damn it, Pimp Squeak! Stop being so cute! <laughs> Looks like Thunderlane was right about the obstacle course getting Rumble to come back home. Hey Rumble, aren't you gonna do our Wonderbolt course? I'm cooking today. Maybe I'll do the course tomorrow. So you're coming back tomorrow? You're not worried about getting your cutie mark? <laughs> yeah, I already know I'm a good friend. It's so cute. Runs in the family. I see that I way too much, don't I? What other stuff I can oh my god. Dogs. <laughs> Okay, it's been a while since we've had a Crusader episode, and it, it delivered! I actually really liked it! It's actually, it's been a while since I've really said that about a Crusader episode. Mostly because there's so few and in between. But, oh my god. Will you shut up?! I apologize for the loudness that is my dog. I only have a cat who is possessed by Satan, but I also have two Shih Tzu dogs. One of them's deaf, the other one can hear us fine, but they still bark whenever they see someone walk past the house out the door. 
Anyway, off topic. Uh, I've read a lot of uh, fi fiction on uh, fanfiction.net about this exact thing about cutie marks being uh, confining about for a pony to just one thing. And this was actually an in a cool way to address it. And I like it just because you have a career in one thing that for the thing you're destined for, you can still be interested and do other shit. You are not confined. There is no box. Well, actually, there is a box, maybe, but guess what? You can go out of it. Rumble and Thunderlane, though. I want to see so much more of them. They're actually a good brother duo. And we don't have a lot of those. We have sister brother, but we don't have brother brother. That is a rare, very rare thing to see. And I, for one, enjoyed the relationship that these two had. Rumble wanting to follow in his brother's footsteps, but being afraid that he may fall into something else that'll keep him from doing it. That's actually a common fear that every, no, well, maybe not every kid, but some kids can have. Like, they're so focused on one thing, they think doing something else will distract them from it and just keep them from accomplishing their goals. No, that's not true. It's just having extracurricular activities, and those can go good on your record. Don't you think so? I mean, you do a lot of things other than just party planning and baking, don't you? Really? You do that? Huh! I never knew! Is it easy to learn? Okay, well, you know what? I have my checkbook in here somewhere. I am, uh, hmm. I am going to write you a check for an upcoming class, and I want to be signed up for it. Huh? What do you say, huh? Sounds not good? All right. I'll get you that later. All right. What do you think, buddy? Yeah, I'm wondering that exact same thing. When uh, Rumble butted heads with Sweetie Belle, how did he not die? I mean, he really just rammed right head first into a goddamn unicorn. How did he not die? Horn, head, what happened? Did it like phase through him like a ghost? What the hell? This is what I think of, people. This is what I think of. And what time is it? Almost six? It's time for me to think about something else. Dinner. Thank you all so much for joining me for this reaction. I have been Princess Deadpool, and I was here with Pinkie Pie the plushie and Max. Today, the day that I'm recording this, this is October 5th. You know what that means, right? Movie! I am so stoked and I know it leaked online, but I haven't seen it yet. And if you fuckers spoil anything for me, I will come for you. And I will tear you to shreds to put in my next taco. I hear human flesh takes good in between meat, beans, and cheese. So do not, I repeat, do not test me. So until the next time, my friends, I'll see you on the internet!